Hey guys, it's Adam aka Swimming Bird and welcome to Animal Crossing New Leaf. Today we're gonna go welcome the newest villager to Goostin and check out what else is going on in town. Jeez, we have so much mail still. I could probably throw this away. This is uh, Cranston's birthday invite. We know that that's gonna happen. So we got four letters that we can read today and still some more in the mailbox. Let's go one by one here. I'll read one throughout the episode. Dear Adam, if you think about it, letters have the power to stop time. They capture one moment in ink for eternity. I love that. And it means you can never age in letters either. From romantic Brofina. So if Brofina ever moved out, then uh, <laughs> we'd have her immortalized in letters. We could never forget her, unfortunately or fortunately. So over here, behind the town hall, we have our newest resident. He moved into Bamboo Central. I really need to get rid of all this stuff. I heard that someone... <laughs> I have to look into this. But Daniel said someone she saw on Tumblr had an issue with Bamboo where they got trapped in their house because of it and basically couldn't do anything in the game. I didn't think you could block yourself into your house because stuff can't grow like right in front of it. So I'll have to look into that. <gasps> it's Poppy! Aw, oh, man. We've got some creepy music going on here. Which one is this? Let's see, Hypno KK. This house is really nice, though. Aw, little nice couch, he's got a frog chair. How's it going, buddy? He almost looks like he's got like a kid's house a little bit. What's up, my friend? Yo, Adam, Poppy's the name, I just moved to town. We actually met when I was camping, do you remember? You asked me to move here. You did say that, right? Anyway, I'm here now. I'll be seeing you around, neighbor. All right, so Poppy, he's a little Okapi. It's a uh, African animal, sometimes called the African unicorn, but he doesn't have a horn or anything. He's just a weird mix of a uh, zebra and a giraffe, sort of. I think it's related to a giraffe. Ooh, we got a uh, <laughs> grasshopper here looking at me. I need to try to catch as many insects as I can. It was actually a grasshopper and not a locust or any of those. I need to get as many as I can because we have a bug off coming up. And I need to try to get, I think I'm missing one piece of the bug furniture. What's up, Cranston? Uh, <laughs> Graham, going fishing. The, uh, the bug furniture piece I'm missing is the spider clock, and hopefully I get, it's weird, some of the furniture comes in, like, sets where if you don't get a certain set during a competition, you just can't get that one, so hopefully we'll get that, and I can complete that. Oh, <gasps> it's Gracie! Oh, uh, oh, hey, Phineas is also here. What's up, buddy? How's it going? Oh, and good day to you, youngster. Walk into the evening. Well, anyways... It always makes me feel uneasy. By the way, is there something you need from me? I guess he's got a badge, I think, for me. Oh, oh, okay, you want a badge, do you? Let's see, what kind of badge best suits you? Hmm. Oh, ho, ho! It seems like you enjoy fishing quite a bit. It makes this old man relieved to see you found a way to enjoy the great outdoors. I've got the perfect bag for you. So uh, I've been trying to catch some fish and bugs and stuff because I want to get the, the ones that are going to disappear. If you keep uh, being good, the badge man will bring you a new badge, okay? Aha! So we got some type of skilled angler badge. Nice. Proof I've caught a lot of fish. Does he have any other badges for me, or is that it? Ooh. I want another badge. Yeah, he's got multiple badges, I guess. Oh, okay, so he wants more. Well then, which one will be good for you? Mm -hmm, I see. Arkarkar, it seems like you've become very informed on the habits of the fish here in town. I got multiple fish ones. Makes this old man happy. Okay, so we're filling out our encyclopedia. What's this one? Thank you very much. I think there's a little, like... I don't know if it's a generic model for the badge, or he, uh... He had gave me, like, a unique one there. Put my net right in his face. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, I'm a fan of fish. Anything else? He just has so many badges, it seems like. Okay, good. That's it. Yeah, we've been collecting some more fish and bugs and stuff. Let's talk to Gracie. She is the key to unlocking the last Nook upgrade. It's been too long. I hope we've spent all the time polishing your fashion sense of style. Uh, I need to make sure this town is fashion forward enough to warrant my opening the store here. I can't let the Gracie Grace brand appear just anywhere, you know. It would reflect poorly on me if I did. On that note, I need you to assist me in a little fashion evaluation. Okay, let's try this. Phineas, what are you doing? Get off her! <laughs> or him, whichever way, uh, whichever region you're playing in. It could be a guy or a girl. Ugh, Phineas, you're creeping me out. Okay, so what is the, uh, what was the competition? The, uh, we have to go theme our outfit. What was the theme? It's, oh, I forgot, <laughs> sorry, I was distracted by the sea lion just, like, jumping on you over there. Historical look. Okay, I'm gonna try to go change my outfit into something historical, more so than Mr. Saturn, and we'll be back. That's definitely in our real rock. What are you lovebirds doing over here fishing? 
synchronized fishing, <laughs> looking at me all creepy. Okay, carry on. Hey, Cranston, what's going on, buddy? You watering stuff? Oh, good, I've been looking for you, Smoopy. No rules. I've had a hankering to play some hide-and-seek. I really want to run around outside. Will you play with me, Smoopy? I'm trying to change, man. We got a fashion check, but okay. Of course, I'll stop everything. The mayor always plays hide-and-seek with his citizens. Oh, let's get some other people. Okay, let's see if we can do this. There's... <laughs> Gracie, sorry, but this is usually where we play hide-and-seek. She's just standing between a little hamster and a big panda bear. Okay, so we got to find all three of them. Ten minutes. Uh, this should be kind of tough because we got bamboo everywhere, but if I'm lucky, they'll hide someplace obvious. Okay, let's look around. It's been a long time since I played hide-and-seek with these little guys. I'm excited. And, uh clock was in my way, but I'm raring to go. Usually they hide super obvious, and uh, they're peeking out all the time. They have a hard time just letting uh, somebody, you know, not find them. It's almost like they want to be found. Hmm. The animals are so dependent on their mare. Maybe that's the whole thing. They just want some attention. Pinky, you're the worst. <laughs> peeping right near me. What? But my hiding place is perfect, Tickle Dog! It must be a pretty awesome secret if you found me, Smoopy. Two more to go, Smoopy. Keep it out, Dingle Dong. <laughs> She's been hanging around Graham too much. Calling me Dingle Dong. <laughs> You're not even behind anything. The police station doesn't have corners. <laughs> Cranston, darn, I guess you found me. I never thought you'd look here, Newt Rules. Alright, I gotta go change, guys. Leave me alone. Can't believe I lost to hide and seek. I'm the reigning champ. A cheese floor? <laughs> Thank you very much. Might actually put that one to use. How's this for historical? We've got a full suit of samurai armor, some ninja sandals, and these weird rimmed glasses that are apparently historical as well. Let's read a letter really quick before we head back to Gracie in our full historical look. So here we go. We got one from Elvis. Hey, Elvis. Oi, Adam! How have you been feeling lately? If you're worried about something you can't talk about face to face, just ask for my advice in a letter. It might help. Just try it. Elvis. So Elvis is, uh, he's just trying to get me to write him more. Also, here's one from Pinky. To ever cool Adam. Whoa, I'm still ever excited from that heartfelt letter I got from you. It's just a thing to pep and idle up when she's overwhelmed by her startup. Thank you so much, your idol, Pinky. That was from her birthday gift. I think she's wearing the shirt that I sent her for her birthday, but I sent it late. So hopefully she likes it, even though she probably didn't even associate it with her birthday, because the animals tend to forget things immediately. Man, everyone's around from hide and sweet seek still. Okay, Graham's gonna watch me get my fashion check. Ready for your fashion check, darling? Let's do it. Hopefully I pass. Don't you sound confident? Well, I have I happen to have a spam moment, so let's get started. It's time for Gracie's fashion check. <laughs> Everyone's, like, <laughs> getting out of here. Cranston's like, I'm leaving. She just yelled at him. All right, historical look. He had one thing to do. Let's see if we managed to pull it off. Step back and look at the outfit. I see what you're trying to do here, honey. That's a bold move, mixing two styles like that. It might be my socks. Uh-oh. Yield historical basic look takes back me back to an era of utter style. It's perfect for this town, honey. I can tell you were listening when I gave you that theme, because you completely nailed it, honey. Talented ghost deserves to be forwarded. Or would it, so <laughs> don't you think so? He has a sweets mini table. Ooh, it comes straight from my personal collection. Think of it as a way of encouraging you. Did we get enough fashion check? This might be number three or four, I can't remember. I've done my share of these little fashion checks, and it's given me a lot of time to think. And I think I'm going to open a new boutique right here in town. Now, don't get all emotional. I don't have the time to deal with a historical fan. Or hysterical fan. <laughs> I am historical as well. I need to start planning my grand opening. You'll be my first customer, honey. Don't tell anyone I said this, but you've been an inspiration to me. So we're gonna get, ah, uh, we're finally gonna get the last upgrade. There is Pinky in her shirt. Okay, awesome. So that means we're gonna see the final nook, the ultimate fulfillment of what the TIY should be. It's our uh, final store, and it's got a lot more new stuff in it, and it'll be a lot bigger as well. Hey, is this a shiitake mushroom? I can't tell. Let me see. It's a, it's just called a skinny mushroom. Let me see what else is going on. Yeah, I thought I saw this when I was playing in Hide and Seek. Even though we have a full village now, we've got a camper still, so it's going to be sad if it's someone that I want to move in. Oh, hello. Avery would like you. What's your name? Amelia. Hey, are you from around here? Oh, great. I've been looking for a local to chat with. I just can't be near Angustin for a little while, but the town is really growing on me. Who knows? Maybe someday you and I will be neighbors. Is she like a condor or something? She looks a lot like Avery. It's weird. But uh, she's the same type there. She's that kind of eagle hawk 
look to her. She's alright, but we already got one guy in here. And uh, he might move eventually, though, because we have a lot of uh, duplicate types of personalities. Anyways, let's do that last letter, and then we're going to finish up for today. I really got to get on my bug catching, and uh, we're going to see Gracie pretty soon. I'm excited. We got a lot going on, actually. Okay, so final letter of the day. I'm almost done with cleaning up my mailbox. Maybe next time. It's from Cranston. Hey, Adam. Okay, jeez. <laughs> it's my birthday on the 23rd. I want you to celebrate with me. The par's at my house. Come no matter what. See you there. He already sent me a letter. Jeez. Cranston, you're really overdoing it. I know it's your birthday. I gotta get him something, of course. Don't want to forget that. In real life, I'm always forgetting that. Oop, we got a, a seven lamp. I think I have like a four lamp or something. Okay, so uh, I'll go buy that maybe. Let's catch a dragonfly and end out. Thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. And I'll see you next time for more Animal Crossing. Goodbye.